Good morning. May I ask that you please remain standing for the national anthem. The national anthem will be performed by soprano Amy Johnson of Richmond, Virginia, who is majoring in music. She will be accompanied by trumpeteer Marin L. Corey, who is also majoring in music from Salisbury. Thank you, Amy, Marin. Please continue to stand for the invocation that will be given by Father Ignatius Zampino of the St. Thomas Aquinas Catholic Church. Father. O oh God, creator of all that is, may we, gathered here at this commencement, become with your grace, a people of sharing and growing, a community of vibrant faith and an environment of special presence, a people of vigor and enthusiasm, a family that learns, grows, and gives, responsive to the needs of all, preserving, spreading, and celebrating offering, and offering hope, comfort, and peace as we prepare to cross the threshold of hope into a new millennium, we ask you to develop, mold, and shape us into channels of your love, witnesses of your life, seekers of joy. Direct and guide us through prayerful labor cooperative effort, dignified work, touch and embrace us, Lord, as a people anointed now, always and forever. Amen.
Thank you, Father. Please be seated. On behalf of the faculty and staff and students of the University of North Carolina at Charlotte, I welcome each of you to this 37th commencement of our institution. It is a joyous event because it's a special time in the lives of our graduates, but also their parents, families, neighbors, and friends. Commencement is, of course, the crowning event on the annual calendar of this or any other university. It defines all that the faculty, the students, and the staff who were brought together to achieve the discovery and the dissemination of knowledge. This morning, we'll be conferring diplomas on about a thousand graduates who have completed requirements of programs in our College of Arts and Sciences, and about 700 of the thousand are with us this morning. And this afternoon, we will confer another approximately 1,000 degrees, and that will be for our students who have completed one of the programs in our five professional schools. Altogether, we then today will award about 2,000 degrees. In December, we awarded about 1,800 degrees. So this institution, during the 1998-99 school year, will have awarded 3,800 undergraduate and graduate degrees, the largest number that's ever been awarded by this campus. Today, we'll also be conferring the degree Doctor of Philosophy on two candidates who have completed the requirements for the PhD in Applied Mathematics. This afternoon, there will be five additional doctorates awarded. There were, there were four in December, so this year, for the first time, UNC Charlotte will have awarded 10 doctorates. Given that these programs only began in 1994, that's quite an achievement for this institution and particularly for our faculty. This morning, we'll confer an honorary degree on a splendid citizen, wonderful contributor to this community, a man who has been a distinguished service, servant to the city, region, state, and especially to this university. Again, it is my distinct pleasure to welcome to this commencement the teacher, the education, educational visionary who created what became UNC Charlotte. Dr. Bonnie Cohn, would you please stand? Thank you, Bonnie, we love having you with us. Now let me say just a few words to you graduates because you are the reason that we have assembled here this morning. We share with your family, neighbors, and friends a great pride in your accomplishment. And may this morning's ceremony be a source of happy memories for you. On this particular occasion, you come together for a common purpose, but otherwise, you are a highly diverse group. Many of you came here as freshmen four years ago. In the traditional way, you progressed toward your degree, and we're certainly proud of those achievements. Others started as freshmen, and for a variety of reasons, took a little longer than four years, but we are very proud of your achievements as well. And still others here this morning transferred after a year or two at another senior university or one of the very fine community colleges in our state and are completing your degree today. We take great pride in your accomplishment. And then we also have with us today 
students who came back to college after several years of interrupted education completed the requirements for the degree while you worked full-time or part-time. All of us admire your commitment and take very great pride in your achievement. Now, among the graduate students are many individuals who came here after an undergraduate experience at this institution, but most had undergraduate experiences at other institutions across this state, a country, and world. Indeed, many of the international students who are at UNC Charlotte represent more than 65 countries. We take great joy in your achievements and are very pleased that you chose to study at our campus. But no matter what your circumstances, we join your family, neighbors, and friends in celebrating what you have accomplished at your time at UNC Charlotte. You've contributed much to the life and spirit of this institution, and we wish each of you great success and much happiness. Now, as a class, you've already made an excellent start toward leaving your mark on this campus. You've created the largest class gift in the institution's history. And this gift will be used to furnish the student study room. This will be a new room in the new library, first floor of the expanded library. And the room will be named for the class of 1999. And a plaque designating it as that will be mounted as you walk in the room. And for that, we're very pleased. What we hope, of course, is that you will stay connected with this institution as active alums throughout the remainder of your life. During our ceremony today, we'll recognize many people, but thousands of others who deserve our recognition and applause are not on the platform or are not down in front of us, but they are in the seats behind you. They're your parents, spouses, children, and other relatives and of course, their support was critical to your success. And often they have sacrificed to make it possible for you to be here today. And I invite all of those in the audience who are parents, family, children, friends, to please stand. All the parents and family, please stand. <clears throat> Thank you. Seated immediately behind the graduates this morning are members of another group that helped you attain your goals. You'll recognize them by their colorful robes, hoods, caps, and other regalia. I would now ask the members of our distinguished faculty to please stand and join me in thanking them. While everyone here today is an honored guest in some way, we also have with us this morning some special people seated in the guest section to my immediate right over the exit door over here. Our alumni leaders, honorary trustees, emeritus faculty, special friends and supporters, and also family members of platform party guests. And would you please stand? Sally, Cliff, would you all please stand? Thank you. I now have the pleasure of presenting to you Mr. Howard C. Smokey Bissell, one of Charlotte's most distinguished business leaders who takes time from his busy life to chair the UNC Charlotte Board of Trustees. Mr. Bissell gives generously of his talents in serving the needs of this growing university, and for that he deserves special thanks. Mr. Bissell will introduce members of the platform party. Smokey? Thank you, Chancellor Woodward. On behalf of my fellow trustees, 
I extend greetings and a warm welcome to all of you on this joyous occasion. We have among us this morning a representative of the Board of Governors of the University of North Carolina. His presence symbolizes our membership in a distinguished state university system and lends added significance to this occasion. We are honored to have with us Phil Phillips of High Point, co-founder and president of First Factors Corporation, which serves the furniture, textile, and apparel industries of North Carolina. He will bring us greetings from the Board of Governors. Mr. Phillips. Good morning. Chairman Bissell, Chancellor Woodward, other platform guests, friends of this university. I bring you greetings and congratulations from the Board of Governors of the University of North Carolina. You know, the University of North Carolina is made up of 16 universities spread all over this wonderful state. Some of the universities are large, some are small, some are urban, some are rural, some are old, 200 years old, some are quite new. Some have specific agendas, specific missions, but most, like the University of North Carolina at Charlotte, have a broad curriculum. In my four years on the Board of Governors, I've come to appreciate the genius of the University of North Carolina system, and I've come to appreciate the University of North Carolina at Charlotte in a much bigger way. You well may be the most dynamic piece of this system, this 150,000 student system that we have here in the state of North Carolina. I was in a conversation yesterday with your chancellor. We had a meeting in Durham, and I asked the chancellor, I said, who's going to be your main event, your main speaker, your main star of the show uh, at commencement on Saturday morning? And Chancellor Woodward looked me very carefully in my eyes, in my face, and said, we've got 1,000 main events to talk about tomorrow morning in Charlotte. You're the star of the show. So let me just say I congratulate all thousand of you here this morning on graduating from UNC Charlotte. And I'm looking forward to your energetic and dynamic leadership as we move into the 21st century. Good luck to all of you. Thank you, Mr. Phillips. Now let me recognize other members of the platform party who will not otherwise be introduced. As they are presented, I'll ask them to stand briefly and be recognized, and I'd ask you to please hold your applause until they have all been presented. We are privileged to have with us six other members of our Board of Trustees. They are Mrs. Stephanie Counts and Mr. Fred Figge, both of Charlotte. The Honorable James B. Jick Garland, former mayor of Gastonia, Mrs. Dorothy Dee Dee Harris, and Mr. Howard Haworth, both of Charlotte, and Mr. Edward J. Snyder, Jr., of Albemarle. We are also delighted to have with us Nicholas G. Marissus, the past president of the Student Government Association who recently was elected president of the UNC Association of Student Governments, representing all 16 campuses of the state university system. By virtue of that election, he will sit next year as a member of the UNC Board of Governors. Let me also present three important officers of the university. Olin B. Smith, Vice Chancellor for Business Affairs, Charles F. Lynch, Vice Chancellor for Student Affairs, and R. Edward Kaiser, Jr., Vice Chancellor for Development and University Relations. We are also privileged to have with us Dr. Richard B. White of the College of Education, the newly elected president of the faculty. Also from our distinguished faculty, we have with us this morning Dr. Owen J. Furseth, 
this year's winner of the Nation's Bank Award for Excellence in Teaching. We are also honored to have with us three retiring members of the faculty who have a total of 98 years service to the university. They are Martha L. Stewart, an assistant professor of mathematics who has served the university for 40 years. Dr. Alfred W. Stewart, a professor of geography and earth science who has served the university for 30 years. And Dr. George Winholtz, a professor of psychology who has served the university for 28 years. And as always, we are pleased to have with us again the university's senior marshal, Dr. Dan Morrill, a professor of history. Now, if you please, a round of applause for these devoted servants of the university. Thank you, Smokey. Now we shall hear from a student, Cornelius de Jong of Pretoria, South Africa, who is a candidate for a baccalaureate degree in communications. And he will bring greetings from the graduating class. Cornelius? Ladies and gentlemen, Chancellor Woodward, distinguished faculty of the University of North Carolina at Charlotte, and especially to the members of the graduating class of 1999, I am honored to stand here today to briefly share with you what UNC Charlotte means to the graduating student. In short, it means freedom. Now, we have labored long and hard so that we can eventually graduate. True, some of us have labored hard, and others, well, they've labored long. But I can assure you that the class of 1999 is very excited to graduate. As freshmen, we had a vague idea of what university was all about, but we committed ourselves to the challenges of higher education. Looking back, I'm sure that each one of us can recall our achievements and failures of the past years but fortunately, our success is not measured by the number of accomplishments we've completed, but from what we have learned through experience and participation. For me, UNC Charlotte is synonymous with opportunity and challenge, and that is why I believe that the graduating class of 1999 is adequately prepared for a new millennium in the last few years, we've been taught and educated in a way granted to only a few, and for this we are very, very grateful. We've been provided with an excellent platform to experience on and to learn from, and without the help of a very capable faculty and staff, we would not be here today. And to the faculty and staff here at UNC Charlotte, we thank you, because you've helped pave the way to a new horizon. To our parents, families and friends, acquaintances, and everyone else who supported and encouraged us through the past years, we thank you because you were the ones that kept us going and gave us assistance when we needed it the most. And to the graduates of the class of 1999, the word commencement is synonymous with initiation, start, origin, and new beginning. Some of us will return for master's and doctorate degrees, and others will tackle careers. But whatever the case may be, we are now at the genesis of our future. I want to thank every graduate in front of me who dared to open themselves up to what UNC Charlotte offers. Regardless of whether your contribution was on the academic, sport, or social front, you've certainly made a difference. Thank you for your commitment. Congratulations on challenges conquered and for reaching your goals and even surpassing them. Everyone can be very proud of you. And you know what? 
You can walk with pride because you are phenomenal. Today, you are rewarded for the work you've done and as you go into the real world, it too will reward you for your contributions. However, we have a responsibility to give back what has been given to us. Now you know yourself and work with it. Run, walk, cry, laugh, sing, chat, dance, think, do or stumble, no matter what, up or down, smooth or rough, boredom or intensity, seize that moment that everyone speaks of, be everything you know you can be, and never ever think that your dreams are unreachable. Congratulations on an excellent job and a job well done. I thank you and God bless. Thank you, Cornelius. Well said. Thank you. I now ask Mr. Bissell and Dr. Denise Trout, who is our Provost and Vice Chancellor for Academic Affairs, to assist in the conferring of the honorary degree. Will Mr. C.D. Spangler, Jr., who served with great distinction as President of the University of North Carolina, please escort to the podium Mr. Russell M. Robinson II. Oliver Wendell Holmes, one of the great sages of American law and letters, once said, the rule of joy and the law of duty seem to me all one. Attorney Russell Marable Robinson II must have been listening for he has made doing his duty to his family, his church, his profession, and his community and state the source of joy in his life. He has served public causes large and small, simple and complex, without a hint of personal ambition, private gain, or individual aggrandizement. He has worked to ensure justice, clarify laws, expand education, promote healing, and encourage charity here and elsewhere. For his selfless devotion to the common good, for his steadfast pursuit of excellence, for his unstinting commitment to the public duty, and especially for his service to this institution, the University of North Carolina at Charlotte, the university confers upon him the honorary degree of Doctor of Public Service. By virtue of the authority vested in me by our Board of Trustees, our President, and the Board of Governors of the University of North Carolina, it gives me great personal pleasure to confer on Mr. Russell M. Robinson II the honorary degree of Doctor of Public Service. Again, congratulations, Russell, and thanks for all you do for this institution and our community and state. Now, to recognize the graduates. As we prepare for this recognition, let me ask the audience to please keep the aisles clear. Photographers and guests, if you would, please do not come down to the lower floor. We will have a private company that takes photographs and takes video tapes, and they'll be available for the graduates afterwards. And as a courtesy to the graduates and their families, we'd also ask that you please remain stand seated and stay for the entire ceremony. Now, you will note that some of the graduates are wearing special symbols that denote membership in national honorary societies. After we have completed 
the formal conferring of the degrees, I would encourage the students to take their parents and family and friends to some of the departments within the College of Arts and Sciences that will be open. There will be receptions there, and the particular locations are listed on page 12 of the commencement bulletin. I would also encourage you to take time to walk around this campus. Graduates, again, walk around the campus with members of your family and friends. Show them where you took classes, where you took laboratory courses, and so forth. There is a map of the campus on page 39 of the program. At this point, I want to thank members of the Alumni Association, volunteers of the faculty and staff, and friends of the university who are assisting us today. We always, and do again, owe special thanks to the student alumni ambassadors who are serving as campus hosts today. We're also grateful to the commencement concert band that has been led by Joseph H. Allison and to the vocal ensemble of the University Chorale that is led by Dr. Nancy Volk. And I'd invite everyone to join me in showing our appreciation with a round of applause. Thank you. Dr. Denise Trath, Dr. Cheryl Brown of the Department of Political Science, Dr. Jack Everett of the Department of Civil Engineering, Dr. Ralph McLeod of the Department of Foreign Languages, Dr. Bill Siegfried of the Department of Psychology will assist in the recognition of the graduates now. And as the deans and I move to the lower platform to begin recognition of the graduates, I'd invite all in the audience stand up and give yourself a break, and then get ready to enjoy a march across the stage. Stand up, please. Please be seated. We shall now proceed with the recognition of candidates for graduate degrees. Dr. Robert Munt, Dean of the Graduate School, will join the chancellor in greeting the candidates. It is now my pleasure to call to the platform the candidates for the degree of Doctor of Philosophy. Each candidate will be escorted by his or her academic advisor. Each also will be invested with a hood that is symbolic of this highest of academic degrees. The first 
is Wafa A. Shamban of Tripoli, Lebanon. She has met the requirements for the Doctor of Philosophy degree in Applied Mathematics. She is accompanied by her academic advisor, Dr. Boris Vonberg. Next is Alexei Malikov of Moscow, Russia. He also has met the requirements for the Doctor of Philosophy degree in Applied Mathematics. He is accompanied by his academic advisor, Dr. Stanislav A. Molkanov. We will now proceed with the recognition of candidates for master's degrees. For the master's of arts degree. Viva Maria Jordan. Elizabeth Ann Hill. Huang Q. Ding, Deborah Yvonne Howell, Alan M. Byrne, Mark Stephen Horton, Laurel I. P. Kittrick, Lillian C. Dinkins, Carrie P. Blocker, Jason Lane Bird, Jamie L. Barefoot, Jonathan Kyle Barker, Marion Purdy Crombie, Kelly Rebecca Landon, Taffy Cornett Graham, Derek Robert Burke, Stephen J. Costanovo, Yon Kim G, Caroline A. Wright, Maria Soledad Stransky, Catherine Lefwich Muir, Ashley Marie Megan, Ronald Bruce Mosier, Linda Ann Zvonar, Aria Sklar, Michael T. Champion, Mary Ellen Jones, Guy Jeffrey Powell, Master of Public Administration, Alfie Nakia Baker. Camisa Arlise Bennett, Paul H. Kramer, Christopher T. Ham, Susan J. Kendall, Matthew S. Livingston, Michael C. Mercurio, James Marvin Oglesby, Jr., Martha Worden Sandberg, Ryman Oren Suttle, Candidates for the Masters of Science degree from the College of Arts and Science. Melanie A. Lauder. Jennifer Louise Bento. Candace Kane. <laughs> Jennifer Lynn Fowler. Rebecca Dawn Boggs. Ellen McCann Houston. 
Yun Ho Jeong, Deborah Merkin Moore, Zhang Kumi Kume, Ning Kiao. We shall now proceed with undergraduate degrees. <clears throat> Dean Shelley Lyons of the College of Arts and Sciences will join the Chancellor in greeting the graduates from the college. African American and African Studies. Stephanie Charlotte Arnett. Mary Beatrice Johnson. Yvonne Jones. Robin McKenzie. Cassandra Carol Thompson. Anthropology. Sharon Jean Dudley. Mary R. Malibus. Joy Player. Meredith Lynn Brown Sneed. Art. Billy Joe Adams. Lynn Yote, Teresa Lynn Yote, Ann Kelly Archer, Crystal Eileen Armstrong, Richard W. Bardos, Landon Wayne Barker, Catherine Clements Bucknight, Courtney L. Burt, Jonathan Ryan Case, John Christenberry, Michael J. Dellinger, Jamel J. Doyley, Kevin D. Floyd, Aaron E. Hensley, Jamie Lackner, Kimberly Michelle Lewis, Scott W. Long, Brandon P. Meshitan, Paul C. Manning, Damon C. Matthews, Sonia Therese Maddox, Kelly Lee Moose, Joseph Allen Neal, Leonard Oliver, Terry Dwayne Pearson, William Clint Pendleton, Crystal Dawn Pope, Benjamin Dayton Ross, Kimberly A. Schlotz, Diane Parker Spate, Bishana A. Upchurch, Brandon T. Willett, Pamela Dawn Wyman. Biology. Sabarish Babu. Anna Elizabeth Baldwin. Sung Hee Bang. Jennifer Michelle Birkenhauer. Mamit Kaur Chadha, Seth Ross Chalnik, Michael John Coleman, James Marie Kutz, Jennifer Lynn Kramer, Gishandi Mertoya Evans, Laurie M. Felton, Erica Marie Fumi, David D. Greenberg, Dana M. Green, Linda Anita Green, Victoria Lee Harris, Hadley Jean Hartwell, Shannon D. Hinson, Heather Juliana Hoyle, Anna Alicia Kavlansky, Sun C. Lee, Nun Lu, Patrick Moss, Brandy Brown Ogle, Emilisa Grace Parker, Pam Dukdat, Melissa Presley, Mark Joseph Prindle, Dashima Rivas Bay, Lainey Marie Reed, Danny Glenn Ross, Fadumo H. Sahai, Jennifer Bronwyn Sellers, Tanya Locklear Shoup. Mary Elizabeth Stiff, David Michael Story,
Kyle James Thompson. Thuong N. Tran. Karen Annette Tucker. Sandra Ifioma. Matthew Arthur Vario. Charlene M. Walsh. Lisa M. Wellman. Michelle Whitley. Leanne Wilbur. Carrie Louise Wish. Jeremy Nathan Young. Chemistry. Bernadette D. Alston. Gavin Michael Berenger. Jennifer M. Blanton. New Bin Thibui. Natalie Ruth Carroll. Corrine Nanette Dixon. Daniel Jason Hogan. Peter Justin Oldenburg. Jacobo Penso. Nan Yuen Quack. Mark A. Reyes. Brent Harper Sellers. Yancey Weathers. Jerry Michelle Williams. King Wan Yim. Criminal Justice. <laughs> Stephanie Ann Bell. Christina M. Bellamy. Branda Paulette Bentley. Carol Lynn Bishop. Brooks Bauer. James Bryan Chilton. Jamie Lee Church. David Bryan Cook. Michelle K. Sear. Brandon Taylor Davis. Tyson Roosevelt Earl. Christopher L. Ewing. D. Nicholas Featherstone. Kenesha Renee Free. Roxanne Frempong. Brian Scott Gray. Jennifer Marie Gwynn. Jennifer Gay Hall. Elliot R. Harris. James Brian Helms. Charles E. Jackson. Wesley Barrett Jessup. Jennifer Darlene Jones. Justin Trent Livonius. Latanya Christina Lynch. Jessica A. Maffio. Tamika D. Marshall. Charlie Lee Martin. Vivian M. McRae. Tanya L. Monroe. Summer L. Patterson. Sonia L. Pierce. Thomas Charles Pride Sr. James Russell, David Eugene Rittenhouse, Jr. Kathleen Vanessa Robertson. Christopher George Schmaltz. Lauren Elizabeth Shanley. Jonathan E. Shaw. Randy Scott Simonson. Jennifer Gail Smith. Katrina A. Tab. Alisa F. Williams. Crystal Deneen Wilson. Edward M. Wisniewski. Communication Studies. Brenda L. Almeida. Roshana Jamila Anderson. Emily Eileen Bodenhammer. Crystal L. Bren, Corey D. Brockington, Kenneth Todd Burton, Meredith L. Campbell, Laura A. Carden, Aaron D. Causey, Alicia Nicole Clapp, David Henry Cobo, Cornelius Dijon, Cherie Durr, Megan B. Dickerson, Candace Elizabeth Deal, Tammy Michelle Duncan, Erin Veronica Dysart, James Bernard Finger, Tremaine LaVar Gardner, 
Meredith L. Griffin, Ashton Redout Gunn, Amanda S. Hall, Scott Hall, Adam, Tony Adam Hill, Stephanie Ann Insiger, Curtis L. Jenkins, Elliot M. Lawrence, Suku Lee, Monica Yvette Lewis, Christine J. Lively, Tamika Rochelle Mackey, Jarek Rashawn McCarter, Tammy F. McGee, Claire A. McPherson, Jory S. Mead, Deborah Wendelin Michaels, Michael, Shani Nicholson, Jennifer Renee Rogers, Ronald Wayne Rucker Jr., Michael J. Schaefer, Jenny Elaine Sparrow, Sandra R. Spiegel, James Michael J. Spink, Catherine H. Stallings, Benita Afia Stevenson, Kimberly D. Summerlin, Jason Archer Todd, Natalie Cole Townsend, Nicole Elizabeth Vickavonich, Catherine Swan Wisson, Dance. Sama Ayers. <laughs> Elizabeth Carol Clay. Beverly M. Glasscock. Elizabeth Michelle McElroy. Jamie C. Nunn. Patty E. Weddington. Peter. Amy K. Ackelbaum. Misty Michelle Francis, Andrea M. Gatewood, Shawnee A. Harper, English, Elizabeth Merritt Ball, Benjamin David Bateman, Lindsay D. Black, Tanya M. Benj, Wendy L. Bigham, Samantha Maston Brown, Travis William Carr, Daniel Lee Clark, Rosemary Toth, Patricia Magram Crump, Kelly N. Daughtry, Kimberly E. Davis, Stephanie Lee Dick. James E. Dover, Georgia Lee Ezel, Matthew Joseph Florio, Kim Edwards Holder, Nudasha Patrice Johnson, Krishan D. Jordan, Lisa King, Jennifer Lauren Larson, Carolyn Beaker Long, Michael C. McCacken, Phoebe B. McClellan, Brian Raymond Murray, Yandrick Parrison, Sarah Pearsall, Sumita Penneth, Lisa Pinckney, Lynn Raymond, Coral J. Riley, Irvine St. Vilas, Stephanie Sean Sark, Kimberly Yonks Smith, Tanisha Shanto Smith, Kimberly R. Suckle, Kelly L. Stout, Elizabeth Dawn Pauley Tyler, Laura Parnaby Varnell, Trisha Lynn Williams, Jennifer Renee Wilson, Lisa Woodburn.
Spanish. Anna Terina Diaz Janessa. Anastasios Gaf Nic Nicholas Anastasios Gafos. Hilary A. Hollister. Silvia Pablo Johnson. Amanda L. Langsdorf. Paulina Layton. Jason D. Sparks. Rumi Suzuki. Leah Christine Wall. Julie Marie Wilson. Geography. Jamie K. Stephen Bradley Benson. Philip Anthony Binder. Charles C. Goins. Todd M. Shanley. Timothy Wallace. Geology. Christopher Mark Baker. Nicole Renee Billado. John Grupp. Kate C. Rem, Remus. Braxton Bryan Townsend III. Earth Science. Amanda C. Brennan. Kevin Dwayne Horton. Scott Andrew Lane. James Garrett Neiman. Heather E. Trivet. Susan Caskrey Yates. Stephanie Danielle Young. History. Adwa Abba Arthur. Reagan Nicole Ash. Shanna S. Benson. Glenn Richard Bird. Miranda Jane Booker. Michael Bryan Bookout. Maureen A. Carney. Michael Anthony Carr. Louise Angela Clark. Matthew Joel Christia. Rachel S. Gaskill. Matthew Clayton Hastings. Wanda R. Khan. Esther M. Lewis. Meryl Alanda Foy. Holly Heinerman. Colette Eva Gilmer. Sa Marie Weaver Sari. Charlotte Marie McEvitt. Travis Todd Michael. April Dawn Morton. April Michelle Patton. Beverly Elizabeth Pruitt. Charles Alton Jr. Randall. Tamika J. Ruffin. James K. Truax. Michael Roy Williams. Mathematics. Kimberly Deanna Belk. Kimberly Diane Gregg. Melinda Lynette Eller. Sean Kirby. Natuyan T. Nguyen. Janine Marie Ripoll. Music. Tammy Michelle Corin. Jason D. Dees. Marin Joseph L. Curry. Amy Wyndham Johnson. Latoria Denise McCoy. Brooke K. Taylor. Philosophy. Merle Crowley Harris. Harry J. Labar. Michael E. Richard. Physics. Okay. Quinn Thomas Sykes.
political science. David Vincent Allen. William P. Anaheim. Andrew M. Arthur. Darren Black. Clay Douglas Campbell. Heather Elizabeth Carpenter. Ashley Ann Cheek. Jess A. Ferguson. Christelle Nadia Fazzo. Michelle Lynn French. Meredith Ann Griffin. Maya D. Hines. Kevin Williams Horn. Latoya D. Hughes. Stefan Ivanov. Adela D. King. James Brett Keeter. Tom Corey. Luke J. Kinberg. Carrie Ann Matthews. William Matheson. Christopher Richard Morrow. Mikawa Arunga Ogada. Donna M. Parham. Christopher Chandek Peace. Joshua Aaron Pollock. Ahmad Ryan. Christopher Matthew Robinson. Jennifer Rollins. Jason H. Simpson. Carrie Ann Strickland. Tanya L. Stroud. Stacy Lee Wilson. Catherine A. Z. Hinder. Psychology. Rosie Ann Elfinito. Kendra Francis Billingsley. William Kenneth Bartels. Amity Binkelman. Misty Lee Bajona. Allison Lindsay Bopple. Kimmy Lynn Bourbon. Beth Ashley Boyles. Amy Lynn Brennan. Julie Susan Boccaccio. Shonda S. Bikin. Jacqueline D. Capers. <laughs> Gujumpi Jada. Demetrios James Clanaris. Mary Nicole Collins. Sonia M. Copeland. Linda K. Brooks. Lakeisha Crawford. Kenya A. Curry. Brian M. Dar. John Michael Dupree. Joe Andrew Dillon. Mabel E. Durant. Amy Lynn Early. Shana Marie Early. Montice M. Edwards. Keith Falls. Jessica Bieta Brooks. Lindsay P. Franklin. Danita Labrette Fuller. Melissa Lee Gallimore. Regina N. Garcia. Melinda Godwin. Melissa C. Goodman. Lori Ann Gow. Lori A. Hoshmar. Jennifer Dale Hartness. Janet Suzanne Hill. Cheryl Grace Hodgson. Elizabeth Ann Ennis. Sharon Derice Jefferson. Mindy Jordan. Leonard O. King. Michelle Lee LeCount. Carolyn J. Luddy. Joseph B. Martin. Susan McLaurie. Freddie J. McMillan. Karen Marie Melmolo. Cynthia Ali Metcalf. Carla Shannon Morris. Patrick Thomas Nodolsky. Ryan C. Owens. Cynthia Joanne Payne. Jennifer Leanne Phillips. Kimberly R. Prince Law. Regina Yvette Riggins. 
Ronald W. Ritchie, April D. Rollins, Jessica K. Ryan, Eric Joseph Schreiber, Heather L. Shepard, Christy Sharon Seip, Alexandria Tanan Smith, Keisha V. Smith, Marina Savernick, Mary Suzanne Smith, Melissa K. Smith, Brooke Taylor Summit, Lori Wells Sustar, Denise Victoria Tolerton, Romina M. Villarreal, Brian Franklin Walker, Jeffrey Dale Thompson, Trevor Diane Underwood, Natalie Page Whitaker, Shannon M. Wooten, Latisha Shante Wright, Religious Studies. Gloria Marie Campbell, Elliot Craver McCarter, Thomas A. Nesbitt Jr., Henry Edgar Swansea, Richard L. Wilson, Social Work, Sarah Blythe Dudley, Robert Marion, Tina W. Matthews, Mona Lisa Warmack Nesbitt, Sociology, Shalondia Anderson, Carlton J. Barnwell, Dakisha Annette Blake, Mary Margaret Bone, Amy Lynn Bjork, Lisa Ann Cacciola, Rebecca Jane Cote, Courtney Elizabeth Craven, Robert Lee Dozier II, Beth L. Stringer, Lori V. Garner, Michelle Sharon Green, Samantha Jane Johnson, Kimberly G. Johnston, William M. Crona, Yolanda Marie Lee, Gerald E. Martin, Martin Lakisha, Lakisha Martin, Virginia Moni, Ashley Mitchell, Kazumi Kuwahara, Mitsuko Miwa, Shalonda Patrice Neal, David Sheldon, Carrie Glenn Simmons, Duela Thomas, Mario P. Torrance, Beth Yaki, Will the candidates for the Doctor of Philosophy degree please rise? Mr. Chancellor, on behalf of the faculty of the University of North Carolina at Charlotte, I have the honor to present these candidates for the degree of Doctor of Philosophy. Upon the recommendation of the faculty of the University of North Carolina at Charlotte, and by virtue of the authority vested in me, I hereby confer upon you the degree Doctor of Philosophy with all of the rights, honors, 
and responsibilities pertaining thereunto. Please be seated. Will all the candidates for master's degrees in all fields of study please rise? Mr. Chancellor, on behalf of the faculty of the University of North Carolina at Charlotte, I have the honor to present these candidates for the master's degrees indicated. Upon the recommendation of the faculty of the University of North Carolina at Charlotte, and by virtue of the authority vested in me, I hereby confer upon each of you the master's degree for which you have been recommended with all of the rights, honors, and responsibilities pertaining thereunto. Please be seated. Will all the candidates for bachelor's degrees in all fields please stand for the conferral of degrees? Mr. Chancellor, on behalf of the faculty of the University of North Carolina at Charlotte, I have the honor to present these candidates for the baccalaureate degrees indicated. Upon the recommendation of the faculty of the University of North Carolina at Charlotte, and by, the virtue, by virtue of the authority vested in me, I hereby confer upon each of you the master's degree for which you have been recommended with all of the rights, privileges, and honors thereunto. Please, please be seated. Let, let me now call to the podium again Cornelius de Jong for a word to the graduates about the positioning of the tassels. Cornelius. <clears throat> graduates, we come now to that long-awaited milestone in our lives, the moment we are no longer students, but graduates. In earlier times, the universities awarded each graduate a hood signifying his or her academic station over the years, that hood for undergraduates has been replaced by a single tassel. Tradition requires that the tassel is worn on the right-hand side of the mortarboard and after graduation, as a symbol of our new status as degree holders, the tassel is worn on the left. Now then, let us signal the waiting world our ascension to a higher order of scholarship by turning our tassels from right to left. Congratulations on a well done job. Uh, of course, I also add my congratulations to each and every one of you. We all wish you a full, happy and rewarding life, a life of service as well as personal fulfillment. We hope that you will leave this institution with the confidence that your education has prepared you for the opportunities that await you. But we do hope that you'll stay connected with UNC Charlotte and come back often, become active members of our Alumni Association. Now I ask that you please stand and join the chorale in singing the UNC Charlotte alma mater will be played by the commencement concert band directed by Joseph Allison. The chorale is directed by Nancy Volk.
Please be seated. Please be seated. Let me ask that the graduates please remain seated <clears throat> while the platform and the faculty recess. <clears throat> and to avoid congestion, I'd ask members of the audience to remain in place while the graduates exit the arena as well. And of course, afterwards, you may join them in the plaza out front. Now, would you please rise for the ceremonial ringing of the old bell to be followed by the benediction? The old bell will be rung by Timothy P. Wallace of Charlotte, a marketing and geography major. The benediction will subsequently be delivered by Father Zampino. After that will come the recessional. Timothy. May the Lord bless you and keep you. May he show his face to you and be merciful to you. May he turn his countenance to you and give you peace. May the Lord bless you. Amen. Amen. Please be seated. <clears throat> 